equation. We have a polynomial equation of degree 4, so we want to solve it. So let me rewrite again this equation. So we have a x in a 4 plus a x cubic is equal to the x squared plus x. If I'm subtracting both sides by x squared plus x, this equation takes the following form, x4 plus a x cubic minus a x squared minus x is equal to the 0. Since every term has x, we can factor x. So x times my x cubic plus x squared minus x minus 1 is equal to 0. So now I want to factor whatever is inside the parentheses. So here is a x times, so let me write uh, with the parentheses and uh, brackets. So then we can factor it just as the first term here, x cubic and x squared. So the common factor is a x squared, x squared times a x plus 1. And here is a minus. I can factor 1 minus in the front and the x plus 1. Everything here is equal to 0. So now we can write x, and let me factor here inside what it is. So what we have here, x, uh, x plus 1 is a factor for the two terms, and we can write here x plus 1, and what remains x squared minus 1. x squared minus 1, and everything here is equal to 0. In fact, what do we have here? We have a x times x plus 1, times x squared minus 1 is equal to 0. And now we want to find out the solution. We take a x is equal to 0. So let me go first, x is equal to 0. So this is one real solution, which happened to be integer. And now we are going to find the other term. I'm taking x plus 1, I equate with 0. x plus 1 equal to 0. When we are solving for x, both sides plus minus 1. So x is equal with the minus 1. So this is a second solution, which again happens to be integer. And the third one, we take this factor x squared minus 1. So x squared minus 1 is equal to 0. Both sides plus 1. So x squared is equal to 1. When we take in a square root, x happens to be plus minus 1. So those are the four solutions, which happens to be all of them integers. So if the solution is that x is equal to 0, minus 1, and plus minus 1. If we want to look, uh, for example, how it uh, is uh, graphically, how we can see graphically, and if you are going in decimals, you plug in, in this equation, you get uh, this uh, following uh, form. So you have uh, x is uh, minus 1 and 0, 0, 0, those are the solution, and 1, 0. So minus 1 is a multiple solution of this polynomial equation.